Leave a like on this video if you like Vanoss Gaming. Yo, 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 what is going on everybody and welcome back to the Top 10 Videos channel. Today we have a very interesting and controversial commentary topic. But before we get into that topic, let us preface this video by saying check out the Fiverr link at the top of the description. If you don't know what Fiverr is, it's basically a website where you can sell services and products. And yes, we have opened up a Fiverr store where we're going to be helping you guys grow your YouTube channels, uh, helping you guys with YouTube thumbnails and just over overall trying to help all of you with your YouTube channels now of course this does cost money if you want to do it so it is completely discretionary to you as the viewer as to as to whether or not you want to make any of these purchases so if you do want help growing your YouTube channel if you want YouTube thumbnails or anything like that check the Fiverr link at the top of the description ladies and gentlemen so anyways getting right on into the video today we're gonna to be talking about why the Vanoss crew might be coming to an end so as you all know Vanoss gaming is a part of a crew if you would like to call it that that's up to you. you could call it a squad a crew whatever you want to call it now with that being said he basically has a bunch of friends that he records with I'm not gonna name all of them but to list a few you've got Vanoss delirious Dahi Denogla mini lad Louis caliber and a lot more and with that being said fans have been alleging that the Vanoss crew might be coming to an end and with that being said we over here at top 10 videos have done some speculation and we have come across a few conspiracies as to why that they actually might be coming to an end you know when we first heard these claims we thought you know it's just a bunch of fans trying to cause drama or it's just people trying to just cause some controversy within the community but we did some further digging and there might be a possibility that the Vanoss crew might be coming to an end so let's get into the reasons why so at the first reason, supposedly the Vanoss crew, aka Vanoss predominantly, wants to spice things up by recording with other YouTubers. So as you know, Vanoss Gaming is pretty much the catalyst behind the crew. He's the most subscribed content creator, he gets the most views, all that sort of jazzy jazz. And with that being said, supposedly he wants to start recording with other YouTubers to spice things up. Or at least that's what the fans are saying. Now we don't necessarily know if that's true or not. Not, because at the end of the day I feel like when I watch his videos he seems like he's having a super duper fun time recording with all his friends so I really don't understand why he would want to spice things up by recording with other youtubers I mean I guess I could understand a little bit because he records with these people every single day so maybe implementing a new uh, a few new personalities ever here and there would be absolutely amazing but at the end of the day knowing Vanoss I feel like he just has such a personal relationship with his friends and he he wants to continuously record with them day in and day out because those are his friends you know a lot of youtubers just record with each other for business reasons just to like grow each other's channels and whatnot but with the Vanoss crew it seems more genuine it seems like these guys are true friends they've known each other for years they've built actual relationships so yes although Vanoss might stop recording with them to record with other youtubers it's very unlikely to happen because Vanoss just doesn't seem like that kind of guy now on top of that, the people within Vanoss' crew want to play different games and some of them don't like the same games as each other. So if you don't know what that means, basically, let's just say for instance, H2O Delirious loves playing GTA 5 and Louis Caliber hates GTA 5. He only likes Gary's Mod and he only likes Watch Dogs. This is just an, an instance. We don't know if this is true. This is just an instance, a hypothetical instance. Now. With that being said, that could cause some controversy within the crew because if they're trying to select what game they want to record for the day, that might cause some conflict between them because if they don't want to play the same game, if, you know, let's just, let's say uh, Delirious is like, dude, I feel like recording Watch Dogs right now. That's the only game I feel like playing. And Louie's like, dude, I hate Watch Dogs. I only want to record Gary's Mod right now. That could cause some conflict within the crew. And these guys play video games for a living, so there might be some games that they love or some games, alternatively, that they hate. And with that being said, that can cause some very deep controversy behind the scenes that we don't even know about there's a great possibility that these guys are getting in fights every single day about what games they want to record because like i said it's their job it might sound kind of just ridiculous to think about that from like 
an outside perspective, you know, these guys are fighting about what games they're playing. Like, dude, these guys are making hundreds of thousands of millions of dollars per year playing video games. Why don't they just record whatever game is viraling at the moment? And it's not like that, dude. These guys enjoy what they're doing. So it's not like that. They want to record video games that they enjoy playing so that they're having fun and that funness that they're doing, that's not even a word, the fun that they're having will be portrayed within their content, within their videos. So that is why that can cause a lot of conflict within the group. Now, these are sheer speculations. We don't know if these are actually true, but there is great possibility that it is because we're only seeing what happens on camera within these people's videos. We're not actually seeing what happens when the camera flicks off. So who honestly knows? Now, getting into another reason, people also claim that it isn't fair that Vanos has such a large subscriber count and is backpacking his friends' channels. And he might just want to start recording with YouTubers his size. So, as we all know, Vanos is the largest YouTuber within his crew. He has approximately 20 million subscribers, or at least at the time of recording this, he's closing in on 20 million. He's growing super duper fast. So, by the time, you know, this video goes up, he'll probably be at 20 million. That dude is growing so fast. I don't understand it, but he deserves it. He's a beast. Anyways, so people think it's unfair that Vanos has so many subs and he's pretty much just giving his friends a free ride to YouTube fame and YouTube success. Because when you're recording with someone that has 20 million subscribers, you are going to get so much growth and so many subscribers and views from that person just because they're huge. And people think it's unfair that Vanos is doing so much for them, but the, you know, doing so much for his friends, but his friends aren't helping him back. And we over here at Top 10 Videos disagree with that claim completely. And the reason why that is, is because, dude, there, you know, there was a time where I actually thought about that. I was like, dude, you know, maybe Vanoss is backpacking his friends. But if you go to think about it, the people within Vanoss's videos make his videos so much more entertaining. So although, yes, Vanoss might have helped these guys' careers, if it wasn't for them, he probably wouldn't be as big on YouTube as well because they add another element to his videos. Think of like Wildcat, Delirious, Calib, Louis Calib, or Dahi Denoglu, Mini Lad. Whenever their you know their personalities merge together into one video, it makes the video so much more entertaining because you have so many conflicting personalities in one video that it just ends up being such a funny, amazing masterpiece. Which is why Vanos Gaming's videos are the best on YouTube, or at least in my personal opinion some of the best videos on YouTube because you have so many different YouTube personalities people from different countries people from different backgrounds people with different accents different voices different laughs and when you add all these elements together it just creates a masterpiece dude it really does you have Vanoss Gaming's editing with H2O Delirious's laugh with I Am Wildcat's you know dark comedy with Louis Caliber's squeaker voice. It's just so many different elements that add up to be amazing. Now, we over here at Top 10 Videos hope that you all did enjoy this video. Let us know down below in the comment section if you want to see more videos like this. This was a last minute commentary. We were going to do this in like a week from now, but we, uh, you know, one of the crew members at Top 10 Videos ended up having some computer problems and he couldn't release a video tonight, which is why we ended up getting up this video now, whereas it would have gone up like a week later. But anyways, thank you all so much for watching this video. Hit that like button and subscribe button if you're new to the channel. We would definitely appreciate that and we will see you all in the next video.